What's up, guys? Leslie Robbins here for Young Hollywood. To my right, Colo Bikini, the man, the myth, the legend. We all know him as Isaac, AFC Richmond's captain. Yes. Hello, captain. Hello. Nice to meet you. Uh, I've met you already. <laughs> I met you already. You've been in LA for a while now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Doing the Hollywood thing, yes. premiere, lights, yeah. camera, action. How's it feel to be in Hollywood? It feels great, you know. You know, my local lad from Peckham, you know, and I'm here in Hollywood. And it's everything that I thought it would be. You know, everyone's great. Everyone's so nice. You know. <laughs> Ted Lasso. Ted Lasso. Yeah. When when I signed up for it, didn't know what it was going to be. Um, loved football, loved the acting, made sense, you know, where I was at in my life. And, you know, God manifests his ways in, you know, small little opportunities. Yeah. You know, it's just, people keep asking me, like, what, like, how do you feel? And honestly, there's not an adjective that I could, like, use to sum up the feeling that I have at this moment in time other than something really English, like Splendid. Take me back to the moment where you heard about a little show called Ted Lasso. They were casting yeah. guys that knew a little bit about football, which we'll get to because you know a lot about football yeah. and actors. So take um, me back to that moment where you said, that's mine to get. So basically like my, one of my best mates is Will Poulter, that, that small actor, you know, he's, he's done a few jobs. <laughs> Good um, guy to know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And um, he was like, his friend Jason is casting for a show that is football based and also a comedy. And he's like, you make me laugh, you know, you can make other people laugh, kind of, you know. <laughs> and I was like, I, I didn't really think much of it. And then he like got in touch with my agent behind my back and then um, kind of like hooked up the audition. So I went to Theo Park, who's the casting director. Love you, Theo. Um, <laughs> I love you too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Um, and, uh, you know, audition and uh, here we are, four years later. Yeah, um, so, thanks Will. It's never too late to start something new, never. You know, I didn't, I didn't go to acting school. Just, just was, you know, egocentric enough to, <laughs> to say, I can do this. But, yeah, I can do that. I can, I can do that. Yeah, 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 cool. Well, Bruce, Denzel, of yeah, course. Cool. I'm joking. Um, but you're not because you needed that. Because I, yeah. nothing else can get you through all the rejection that comes your way if you don't have that mindset. I can do that too. I mean, you know, who's, if you don't believe in yourself, who's going who's, who's, who's to believe in you? It's not like you're not like full of yourself. You're not full of it if you believe in yourself. It's a, it's a very, very positive mental attitude, you know, from, to believe in yourself, you know. Some people go overboard, of course, and then you can rein them in. But never, never, you know, get onto someone for believing they can achieve something. You know, I'm from Peckham. I'm here in Hollywood, baby. <laughs> you know, but, you know, I just, I take day by day. Well, talk about cliche if you could tell that kid yeah. from yeah. London something, what would you tell him? Younger me. Yeah. Just slow down, man. Like, everyone's always like looking at other people and, and overanalyzing it and, and judging themselves based on someone else's credits. Ev everyone gets their day, you know, everyone has their time. And it might not be your time now, but it will be. Just stick to your guns. Pretty much, that's what I'd say to, yeah, just have fun. I think you're having fun. Yeah. Life imitating art, art imitating life, I think it all blends together. Yes, yes it does. You're living Ted Lasso. Yeah, having a great time. <laughs> yeah. So we're at an amazing facility called Lab 5. Yes. Uh, there are fields everywhere and, yeah. and we're going to play because that's what you do yeah. in real life and on TV, which is amazing. Yeah. But this was your thing. It was. And and then you switched to acting. And so talk about that trajectory, how that I came know, to be. Like, I've always been, you know, even when my soccer quote unquote career ended, um, I was always positive about the sport. Like it, it, 
it really helped me through some really like you know tough times and you know for it for it to come full circle like this is is a beautiful thing you know it's kind of like I don't want to say manifesting when it's myself you know you don't really do that you know when you're like oh I manifested it I don't want to sound like that kind of person that's you know it's really cringy for me but to be honest for me to go from playing soccer to now being in a soccer show acting and being on FIFA and all that kind of stuff there must be some sort of you know mysterious behind the scenes kind of thing that that's you know at play here because you can't really you can't really write this kind of stuff you know well the writers of Ted Lasso write stuff just yeah, like yeah. this you you <laughs> made a perfect segue into yeah. the writing of this show yeah. you, you almost sound like you're living yeah. the mantra and the <laughs> belief system that mm. Ted Lasso provides to mm. everybody. Uh, were you always like this or kind of the the energy and the spirituality of the show became part of you? It it, it rubbed off on me a little bit. Uh, you know, I, I, I would be lying if it didn't. Um, you know, the way that they work, I, I honestly don't know how they do it. Like, they're all geniuses. Genius. Yeah. yeah. You know, the way they can, like, put words on the page and make it come alive like that. Another thing, like, if I wrote a story about my life, people would literally call it fiction. They wouldn't call it non-fiction. It would, it's stuff of, like, you know, that that never happened. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, there's, there's some sort of uh, 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 Hollywood romance in, you know, here. But it's really true, you know. I was a footballer, and now I'm playing a footballer, and they're writing me in the show, and, you know, Shout out Joe Kelly, Brendan Hunt, Brett Goldstein, and Jason Stakers, and all of the writers, all of the crew of Tilla. So everyone works so hard, so hard, like day in, day out, like early mornings, you know, like crack of dawn. And it's, it's not warm in England. No. <laughs> it's, it's, it doesn't matter how many jackets you wear, it still is like that kind of cold that's in your bones, it's kind of hugging you, you know. And they get up and drink a coffee and they get right back to it. And I, that rubbed off on me that, you know, I want their work ethic. We're talking about <laughs> being on set though. I, yeah. I have to ask you about Jason, Mr. Ted Lasso himself, Jason? the yes. executive producer, the star, oh. the, the man behind the show. Mm -hmm. What's it like being on set with him? Does he uh, give you direction or he kind of lets you guys do what you want? Oh yeah. He's yeah, a yeah. mentor, a friend. Jason is, Jason is, He's, yeah, his title is, but he's just much more than that. He, he lets you, like, breathe. He lets you, like, be creative. He lets you, you know, add things. Like, if you're going to add things and if, if, it, if it works, you know, it's in there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He just lets us do that and he'll rein it in and he'll, you know, he'll, he'll let us go and he'll rein it in. Like, and there's some things that he comes up with and I'm like, how the blooming neck? Very English. Mm. How the bleeding neck did yeah. you think of that? You know, and that's, that just comes from being, I suppose, a genius. Like, there's no other word for it, to be honest. You, know, you have to just see it for yourself. Your soccer slash football skills. Yes, football is all about balance. It's all about balance. There's a reason why Messi is the best player in the world. It's because he has a low center of gravity. The guy can literally be, like, you know, like the, the super bikes, where they're like. Sure. Yeah, it's yeah. all about being able to swivel and turn. Okay, yeah. Okay. It's a lot like dancing, yes. Well, truth be told, I'm not a soccer player. Okay. Football player. Okay. Not, not at all. That's okay. But I'm going to learn from oh. <laughs> the captain of yeah. Richmond. Yeah. Yeah yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And and I actually have to say, while we're on the way to the shoot, yeah. <laughs> I get a call that you guys are going to be a few minutes late. Yeah. This is a great story because you wanted to stop and get cleats for our segment, which is yeah. amazing in and of itself. Retail therapy, you know, <laughs> it's a thing. But here you are, yeah. here's Isaac, Yes. Ted Lasso guy, right? Yes. Yes. Walking into a sporting goods store yes. in the middle of LA to mm -hmm. pick up cleats. Yes. Can you write it any better than that? No, only the fact that we don't call them cleats. Spikes. No, I mean, I'll, you know, soccer, Oh, no. I, I'll let you have that one. I can't, I can't stomach cleats. It's called boots. Boots? They're called boots. <gasps> I wasn't going to even yeah. think 
that. And my cringe is like, oh, I call them cleats. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Boots, walked in there, yeah. Got some boots, said, Bosh, give me the Predators. Boom. And <laughs> yeah. And, and did anyone stop you and say, No, no, there was a guy. Like, Wait, what are <laughs> Who knows? you? Well, you weren't recognized though, which I find fascinating. Are you usually recognized? Wait, I heard a story, something about, someone's like, oh, you look like so-and-so. Did, oh. did, did you actually own up to being him? Or yeah. you're like, Oh yeah, yeah that's yeah. the story that I, I, I was on my Twitter. That, that legit happened to me. Like, um, me I, story, I got yeah. a haircut and I, I was feeling good, you know, come out of my barber shop, feeling fresh. Boom, one step. He's like, oh my days. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, my head. Like, <laughs> no, I wasn't, I wasn't. Um, um, he was like, you look like Isaac McAdoo. And I was like, I am Isaac McAdoo. And he was like, no need to lie, mate. <laughs> And then he walked off and I was like, oh, that really hurt. You know, I was like, went in back in the barbershop, was like, what did you do to my hair, man? And he's like, the same thing I've always done. No, but that guy just didn't believe me. And then I put it on Twitter and everyone was like, you've been um, Tony Hawked. Yes. You've been Tony Hawked. Apparently it happens to Tony Hawk a lot. Yeah. Yes. You know, Tony Hawk's on the airplane and be like, you look like a guy that does skateboarding. And he's like, I am the guy that does skateboarding. And he's like, where's your skateboard? He's like, here. He's like, poser. I was like, and the sports store would be like, <laughs> where are your boots? Uh, I just bought them. Yeah. yeah. He's like, Isaac Matthews wouldn't be in the store <laughs> buying his own boots. Yeah, he would. Yes, he would. I love They're it. They're amazing. Okay, so what are you going to show me in the world of football, soccer? I can teach you dribbling, I can teach you shooting, I can teach you how to score goals, score a lot of those. I'm like, <laughs> no, I can teach you a lot of things. Well, I can teach you how to header a ball properly, I can teach you, you know, there's, I can teach you how to do some kick ups, I can teach you, you know, some skills, I can teach you whatever you want. We got a list, let's run, run it down. Yeah. Let's yeah. do a top three. I like yeah. it. Yeah, I can teach you how to shoot properly, you know. Right? I can teach yeah. you the basics so that you can, like, show, you know, you know, when you're at the beach and then sure. someone has a ball yeah. and everyone's like, you can just be there and be like, I got this. I got taught you know, by the best. Boom. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So you just control it. Okay. Pass it. Okay. There you go. Yeah. So you just pass it with this part of your foot. Got it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I can make it, yeah. A couple things. Yeah. Let's do it. Of course. Boom. All right. Okay. Let's do it. There you go. So the secrets of the show, everybody knows a little bit. Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was great. That everybody was knows great. a little bit about football. They're yes, not yes. pros, but they have to know what they're doing. Yes. 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 Of course, um, that was like one of the like actual things about the audition process. Yeah. So you have to show a video of you like just doing like kick ups and all that kind of stuff, like you know what I'm saying? And um, yeah, everyone had this like flashy like trailer, you know, explosions in the background, boom, like torpedo foot. Me, I was just in the park <laughs> with my cousin and he was filming it on his phone. And it wasn't even like one of them good phones because that was four years ago. It might have been like an iPhone 6. <laughs> the camera wasn't like, it was kind of pixelated. Yeah. So when they come back and was like, yeah, that was a great vid. I was kind of like, how? They saw your eyebrow even yeah. in that video. Yeah. That's it, that's yeah. it. Yeah, the eyebrow, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, what's up? That's all right, all right, yeah, yeah. Basically, what do you want to learn? You want to learn how to pass, you want to learn how to shoot, you want to learn how to do kick ups, you want to learn how to do whatever. First of all, when you get the ball, yeah? yeah. When someone passes, if I pass you like this, yep. never put your foot up. Those are footballers, like, it's like a cardinal sin. It's like, huh. if I pass it like that, then basically you put your foot up. It's just gonna go over there. So you plant your foot like that, yeah. and then pull the touch there. So, okay. plant your foot, I pass you like that, there you go. Bosh, there you go. Now you've got control of the ball, yeah? Yeah. Now, you want to beat the fender. You comes here. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can do a little step over. That as in, do that, that, do that. Over the ball. 
then you can flick it with the other foot. There you go, there you go, yeah, yeah, wicked, wicked, wicked. Yeah. So I just kind of like faked you out? Yes, yes, that's all about it, it's all, it's all, it's all about it. So you just, boom, that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you're, you're a defender. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so okay, so I'm gonna pass you the ball, okay. yeah? And then you're gonna do it, yeah? All right. Wait, but so am I telling you where to pass it? You're kind of getting yeah, the yeah. cue so from me? Yeah, that, yeah, that bit there, that, that you're showing me, yeah, give it to give it to my right oh. foot. So you like, or if I did the, no way. Yeah, because. Oh, so you're taking the cue from your teammate where to pass yeah. it. You're not just it passing depends, it. No, no, whatever oh. you, like if, you, if I passed it to there, yeah, you're, you're in trouble there, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. And then that's how the defender can tackle you. But if I, if I passed it to the foot that you're showing, boom, then I can, then I can just go. There you go. You know okay. what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, it's all very, very like, I don't know, scientific, might be, I don't know. You know what I mean? It's all like, you know, because everyone's sizing each other up. So if you've got like a defender here, yeah. yeah, and I'm passing it to there, yeah. that defender can't tackle you there. You know, but if I pass it there, I get tackled. Very like. But the other team will know what foot you're asking to. It's all very quick. Oh. It's all like within like two Got seconds. Got it, okay. So if I was like, if the if, if defender's like here, yeah, and he's like, you know, whatever, yeah. jostling, and then the midfielder's got the ball, uh -huh. and he passes it to you there, no, no, no. Oh, it's supposed to be here. Yeah, so you put your foot out like that, bosh, then, boom. Then you can, you see, now you've got control, now I'm, now, see? Come, and then, <laughs> <laughs> I tried to score. Then, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, then you can't, you can't, you can't get tackled. Okay. Yeah, shoot in, yeah. Basically, if you want to shoot it hard, okay. you just basically, okay, it's like, you, you open it out and then you shoot like, you know what I'm saying? So you lace it, laces is hard, but if you want to place it, use that. Yeah. Or you can do outside foot which is like stuff that Zidane does and that, that's a bit, it's a bit like elite. Like, You're elite? Yeah, yeah, I could do, yeah, I could probably do it, yeah. I've scored some goals like that before, but that's in the moment, do you know what I mean? Look. Now, okay, but yeah. I mean, the problem is there's always gonna be someone on the other team trying to stop you. But that's where you use what I just taught you a minute ago. So what you do is you plant your foot, there you go, boom, then yeah, you shoot, there you go. Yeah. So dribbling. Oh, dribbling, okay. So dribbling, you got. You want to keep it close to you. Okay. Don't do like what Marcus Rashford, Marcus Rashford does, he's just like super fast. So he can just like boot it about 30 yards and then he knows he's going to beat the defender. Yeah. You just do this. This is, this is dribbling. The dribbling, there you go, this here. You have to just do the, it with your toes or the side of your... The, 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 the best way to do it <laughs> is, is, is actually with, yeah, where? It's with, it's with your... That. This part of your foot. Okay. Yeah, so oh, yeah. you're able to just... Oh, no way! You know what I'm saying? And you keep it ahead of you, so you can move side to side, I side to side, side to side. So you can't... Because if, if, you, if you dribble like this, it's, it just looks weird. Right? <laughs> it, do, it doesn't, <laughs> you know, it doesn't look you sexy, you can't run, you. Yeah, no. You can't run, you can't... You know what I mean? Yeah. So, you know, you, you can dribble, then you can move it, you can move it. You can, you know what I'm saying? Basically, yeah. Yeah, there you go. I did not know you dribble with the kind of top it's kind of, you got to caress yeah. it. Like, like you know, you, you, like you know the ball for a while. You like, have to not, love the soccer ball. You got to, you, you got to, yeah. You got to love it. Yeah, that's why they call it a beautiful game. I mean, you got, you got to love it, you know? Yeah. And then you got to hate it when you shoot it. Well, you love it because it's brought you so much. It has, yeah. yeah. Brought you, it <laughs> brought you so much joy back then and it brings you Joy it does, now? it does. Football is like, for anyone that plays football, it's, it's the best source of like, you know when you go to the gym and it's for like your mental health and you releases endorphins and you get all that, you know, sometimes life gets you down and then you, 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 you know, you go to the gym and you have a great session and you release some of that tension and whatever. Um, football does that for a lot of people. It's like, a, it's, it's, it's a sort of, it's a sort of therapy, you know, when you're with your boys and that, 
and you play a play a football match, even if it's like a five a side, even anyway, even if you got you got you put your your jackets down and make goals, like it's still like it's a source of therapy and it, and afterwards you, ain't nobody played a game of football and come off the field unless you're I mean it's your job. Like come off the field and regretted it. Oh, I hated that. I, I should never have done that. That never happened. Same as the gym, innit? Yeah. You hate going to the gym. But then when you come back from the gym, you're like, eh, no, I was, yeah, I was in there, you know what I'm saying? I was doing my thing, like, yeah. But um, that's how loads of lads look at football, innit? Like, you know what I mean? Like people, it's almost like a religion. It's like a religion, yeah, you know what I mean? it, it, Football, it, it genuinely affects me when, when my, the team that I support loses because it's in my heart, you know? I think I think the sport is in your heart. Mm -hmm. I think the show has seeped into your heart. Yes, it has. Art imitating life, life imitating art. I think it's all kind of one for you. Yes. Uh, normally, I would high five at the end of an interview because we but did like, great. You, you, but you've got skills, though. I'm, but I'm, I'm, but, but <laughs> I, I like I gotta come. Like you, 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 you need a hug. You need a hug. You, you're it. Oh, you're it. Thank you so much. You, thank you, for you me, are man. Ted Lasso's like captain. It's, Yes. You're living it. Yes, yes. Um, yeah. Um, thank you for having me and thank you for all this. Uh, lab five. Great. Wicked. Yeah. One last move before we go. What do we got? Good. Wait. Oh, here we go. She's coming in. She's coming in. She's dribbling. She's dribbling. There you go. All right. Oh, no. <laughs> Can she do it? Can she stop it? <laughs> <laughs> okay. oh. Oh, yeah. She's got skills. You actually, she got. You played before, innit? She's she's fooling me. <laughs> <laughs>